everyone welcome back to the vlogs i am obviously sitting at my desk right now it is 8 a.m just wanted to start this video and say welcome to the new office it is going to be our first video in the new apartment and i'm just so excited to share it with you to keep organizing with you because there's still some stuff that i need to take care of i have a few things planned today for that to get this apartment more sorted i've been kind of getting back into my routine of things I have to meet my dad for some stuff at I think 9 or 10. Um, I also have quite a bit of editing to get done. I have a video film that I want to put up in like two days so I just want to get that all sorted and wrapped up. Right now I think I'm going to write my to-do list also. I just wanted to tell you guys Thank you so much for helping me hit 40,000 subscribers on this channel. I can't even explain how insane that is because last year I had literally 90 subscribers and it's just like really mind blowing to think about the fact that like people like watching my videos and hanging out with me because this is like what I've always wanted to do. Good morning. Good morning. Okay, guys, it is 9 a.m. and it's time for me to get dressed because I have to go meet my dad. But I'm obsessed with this get ready space. Isn't it so cute? There's like a little vanity area in my closet in case you didn't see my last video. This is what's going on. I got these jeans, they're new from Madewell, and the fit is like insanely flattering and cute. They're like high-waisted and straight leg -like jeans. Okay, this is cute, I like this. I'm gonna go run like two errands that I have to do. So my dad just left, it's about to be one right now. Um, and I'm gonna make some lunch. He helped me mount the TV in my room, which is amazing. And he put the cables in the wall, which saved me money because I was gonna hire someone to do that. Now I'm gonna make myself a little hummus and veggie wrap. I was cutting these baby bell peppers. I'm gonna saute this with some mushrooms, put it all in a wrap. I just made the wrap. Let me show you what's on it because this is like one of my favorite lunch meals. This is the wrap. Then I spread some spicy hummus. I really like the kava one. And then I put some butter lettuce. I sauteed the bell peppers with the mushrooms, put some diced avocado. And then I like to add just a little line of this 
avocado Greek yogurt dressing. I like the way these two taste mixed together for some reason and I want to have some chips with it. Okay, I think I'm gonna have these jalapeno potato chips with it. A little home update is that I put this mirror that I had in my living room at the last apartment in like this little hallway before my room entrance, which I love. I think it opens up the space even more. But I wanted to give you an outfit of the day. So I got this top from Madewell and I bought it with these pants, which I already told you guys about. And then I have this brown belt from a boutique near me. I'm wearing these Adidas Gazelle shoes. Earlier I went with my dad to get a coffee from Press. So I saved it because I knew that I was gonna want it. Now what I'm going to do is I quickly have to send out like two emails and then I'm gonna plan and like schedule my month because it is the beginning of May and I need to like schedule in content, schedule in like other things. I'm just pulling out my content calendar. I showed you guys this in one of my more recent videos. It feels like I filmed that so long ago because I like took a few weeks off of filming. I showed you guys the content calendar and like how I plan my content and like all of that. I'm gonna be using that same calendar. I've been loving it. I've just finished planning the content for the month. This is what we're working with. And here I have video ideas that I think I wanna do for the month. Uh, sponsors for the month and then I'll like schedule all of that stuff in and color code it so that way it looks all pretty and I know what's happening. Okay, so I only have to do like one more major thing today which is edit Saturday's video. I want to try and upload more than once a week and especially these past I feel like month my content has just been completely slacking and I'm doing my best not to be hard on myself about it because obviously some really crazy shit was happening in my life. I've been feeling the urge to upload more, film more, because I just miss feeling really proud of my content. I'm going to edit Saturday's video. Uh, should I give you guys an office tour of like what things are looking like right now before I start editing? I think I should. Let me just preface by saying it's a mess no matter what. It's like an organized mess on the floor. There's piles of things that still need a place or need to be put up. So you obviously walk in through that door and then right here, I put my little bookshelf and I have all of my books on there. This is maybe temporary. Do you guys like how all the books look like with all the color? Do you think that looks cute? I have it by fantasy, romance, and thriller. Actually, that's not romance. Renee put that there because he's reading <laughs> Billy Summers. And then on this side of the room, I put that console that was in my book nook. I decided to put it in my office because there's not really a space for it out in the living room. And then in there I have like nonfiction and then books I haven't read yet. And then coming over here, I love this little corner. I had this next to my desk at the other place. It's my little Ikea Alex drawers. So I put up this print. I got it from Desenio and I think it looks so cute, especially with like the pastels going on under it. And then in the middle, I just have my desk um obviously you guys have seen this before i have the shelving that i had in my room at the last apartment i put it in here and decided to like make it more decorative i had my purses on it and then this is where it gets a little messy i just have prints there that need to go up um but i don't know exactly where i want them and then obviously my clothing rack with the super cute ball lamp this is clothes that i've either recently bought or clothes that i want to wear like soon um and i just put them here so that way i can remember to either film in them or take pictures in them i am going to order a desk which i will be showing you guys so i feel like that's going to make the room come together even more and then once i put the prints up obviously and like organize this a little bit better um but this is the current state of it and i really have been loving working in here We can start organizing and like decompressing from the work. I know I have to organize some stuff in my closet 
Oh, also, let me show you this. My dad put up, well, he put up both of my TVs, but he did the living room one um, a few days ago. And then he came and put the one in my room in today. Now I can finally put the stuff on my dresser. I was waiting to do that because I knew I was gonna have to move my dresser so they could put the TV up. The box is over there, so we can finally unpack that. And then around 6.30, I'm gonna go meet Sarah so we can get a drink and catch up. I think we should start with this like medicine vitamin cabinet that I have. I bought a organizer for a tip in case you guys need like any of those clear containers for your house or your apartment they are so much cheaper at home goods do not go to the container store so yeah let's just get some stuff done around the apartment <laughs> Everything fit perfectly so I just have like vitamins on this side and then like medications on this side that also just made me remember that I did not take my AG1 this morning so I need to do that here's the dresser right now so i pretty much organized it how i had it at the other apartment i think it looks cute i like where it's headed i just need to add like a few more things but, and now i just need to clean up this but thank god that that box is empty and this is all finished just cleaned a little bit um we can finish organizing when i get back to head out to go meet Sarah. It's officially unwinding time. I'm back from drinks with Sarah. It this is my first bath in this tub and it feels so good. I have my little candle lit, my tray is ready. I'm gonna watch some YouTube. I'm just gonna be in here for a while. So I got home and Renee being the great boyfriend that he is, had Chipotle ready for me. He brought it and dropped it off for me, which is the key to my heart. Wow, that looks like heaven. Good morning guys, it's the next day. Um, I just made my AG1, it's 10 a.m. I've been up trading, I just finished and changed quickly. I also cleaned and tidied a bit of the house. Day is like a short day for me. I'm leaving back home with Renee at like 3.30. So there's just some stuff that I need to get done like before I leave. It is Friday, so it feels very chill. It feels very appropriate to have like a little half day. And I'm just gonna write out some of my to-dos and finish this. Unboxing time. I just brushed my hair, refreshed myself quickly. It feels like that Texas summer heat, which is just like the most unbearable thing in the world. We're not gonna focus on that though. Um, let's start with the small ones first. It's like these little hooks that came with my pans, like my cooking pans, and it's to hang the lids up in the cabinet. We obviously can tell what it is. Just the refill for 
my athletic greens. Oh my God, this is so cute. You guys may know that I'm a Nut Pods ambassador and they just came out with their creamy cold brew coffee. They put it in this little Nut Pods tote. This is the vanilla caramel flavor. And then we have their creamy cold brew coffee in classic. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. They sent a Nut Pods like those beer glasses and then it says happy sipping. Thank you Nut Pods, I love you. The Kenzie laser hair removal device. Uh, but I'm gonna be testing this out for the next two weeks and then I'm gonna tell you all about it in an upcoming video. Guys, look at how cute the coffee bar is coming along. It's not done, but it, oh, this is an aloe return that I need to do. I bought like the wrong socks and I need to go return them. But look at how cute this is coming along. I have this like super adorable print up there. It's like a, obviously a coffee print. It says good morning and it's like this girl diving into her coffee. If you have any suggestions for the coffee bar, please let me know because I'm open to ideas for how I should decorate this space. Got the espresso shot. I really like the mock vanilla for my lattes. Now it's time to do the chores that I need to get done. Guys, I still haven't caught up on laundry for moving. Like this is laundry that I haven't folded in like a week and a half. I'm not proud of it, but at least I'm being honest. sheets that I just put on my bed it's like this pink gingham print and then on the other side it's basically reversible it's just this baby pink and then the sheets that came with a baby yellow and like pink gingham pillowcases this is from a company called everlasting and I think these sheets are so cute for the springtime and this company has really cute very like Pinteresty designed uh, sheet sets um, and I will have a code that you can use if you want to shop from them and get some money off but now I'm gonna do my laundry just wanted to show you guys an update to the room So I'm in my closet now and I think I'm going to unpack and organize my jewelry because that's one of the last things that I am yet to do. And I asked you guys on Instagram on a poll if you'd be interested in me showing you like my favorite pieces while I unpack them and like a little jewelry tour. So I'm gonna do that right now. This is the jewelry organizer that I have. It's from Amazon. I have all of my jewelry in baggies, so I'm ready to put it all away. Okay, so I'll show you like quickly ones that I have. So I have this like little pretty, like it's like these beach pearl necklace. I got it from H&M. No, I got it from Zara in Mexico. So next I have this really pretty body chain. This is from Love AJ. I like to put all my long necklaces at the back and then the shorter ones at the front. So this one's like this gold coin necklace. Um, I got this in high school. I like it because it's like a chunkier statement piece. I always forget to wear this one, but I think this is from a brand called, it's it's something like Wild Child. Then I have this pretty like gold link necklace. This one's from a brand called Hey Harper. I remember I got it in 2020 when those were like super trendy. Okay, and then there's this beautiful necklace. This is one of my favorites. You guys have seen me wear it before. It's by Chloe. This is one of my favorite necklaces. I love how bold it is, but also simple. It feels really high quality. Um, so this is like one of my faves and I think it's still on sale. So I will have that link down below because I love that necklace so much. And then I have like some gold bangle bracelets. These are from Revolve. This is also one of my favorite necklaces. Um, it's like those snake chains. These are beautiful for the summer. I love wearing it with like a tank top. 
these are from fallon jewelry and i got them like two years ago because it's like a collaboration they did with hailey bieber and they came out with like several kinds of those i also have this thicker one which i love to wear with like a little spaghetti strap dress or something and they also had different lengths of it so i literally have three different types and then another gold link necklace this one's also from hey harper i don't really wear those anymore but they're so 2020. <laughs> And then I have this really beautiful one from Pidi Paola, just another gold necklace. This is a choker that I love to wear as a bracelet. I like to wrap it around my wrist like twice. It's from Child Wild. This is another favorite. It's a really dainty linked necklace with an R for Renee. Um, he got it for me from Nordstrom like a year and a half ago. So these are some that I don't hang up just because they're like nicer pieces. I have this silver link one from tiffany's um it's one of my only silver pieces but i got it a few years ago and i like to keep it in its like case just because it's like a designer piece and then i have this really cool like gold belt like with a dress you know um and this is also from love aj these are some of my favorite bracelets it's just like these gold beaded ones i like to wear them with the bangles especially on vacation it's very cute um and i just got them at like a random boutique that's pretty much it for necklaces now i just need to put my rings away and on this little platform i just have um my earrings my rings in this little holder right here so i always get questions on where my rings are from so i'll just go through them quickly with you i have this really pretty one that renee gave me for my birthday it's my birthstone i also have this beautiful ring with these gems on it it's my grandma's ring um, so that one also means a lot to me. It's one of my favorites. I have these two rings that kind of stack on top of each other and these are from Piri Paola. I have this dome ring from Majuri. I have this beautiful jeweled ring from Dior that Renee gave me um, when we went to Europe together. There was like a little bumblebee figure on top of it that fell off. I have this like stacked ring from Young Frank. This really pretty dainty ring from Ligne. This like gold ring with roman numerals on it and this one is from tiffany's hopefully you found a little bit of inspiration from that and i also hope you guys like the closet and how this is like a little filming hangout spot for us now i love it so much and this is how the jewelry looks all hung up and organized I'm sitting here in my office and i wanted to show you guys the desk i'm thinking of getting um it's on sale right now so this is what it looks like it has like a really pretty grass cloth texture to it and it can also be made into an l shape which i really like it's from crate and barrel and i was going between this one and this other one from pottery barn i want an l shaped desk i think because i need more space because sometimes i'm using my laptop and my ipad and the monitor and there's literally not enough room for everything to sit on my desk originally i wanted this one from cb2 that's like got so trendy and it was my dream desk for a long time the issue is that it's just like a desk with like no storage i like the crate and barrel one because it has storage i don't know i will update you guys on my instagram which desk i end up choosing if i haven't ordered it yet which one do you guys like it's 3 45 right now and renee is on his way to come get me because we are gonna head home for the weekend thanks so much for hanging out with me i love you guys so much for watching and it was really fun bringing you along. We did a, a lot of adulting, a lot of organizing, a lot of settling in. Um, it's been my first days alone in my apartment. So you guys got to see all of it and come along for all of it, which is really fun. I love you guys and I will see you guys in my next video.